Well, let me ask you this then, bringing it back to you. Um, would you ever consider something local? Would you consider a city council? Would you consider mayor? Would you consider <laughs> not, mayor. <laughs> not mayor? Fair enough. Fair enough. But, yeah, but um, in any other place, mayor would probably be an easier run. But in New York, understandable. City, it's understandable. <laughs> but um, but you, but you could call Giuliani, ask him for advice. Oh yeah, <laughs> you could. Yeah, totally. Could you imagine um, what that's like? I. You would like see Giuliani and, and he may, maybe he doesn't know who you are at all, you know, and, and you're just like, so I'm, you know, I'm a democratic socialist. I want to run for me. And when he <laughs> hears that word democratic socialist, he just like freaks out. And then he's just like, and then he's like, I was mayor during nine 11 and he throws a bar stool and then just like collapses and, and, and runs out of the bar. And that's yeah. your entire interaction with him. I think that's accurate. That's probably, you got to film that. Like That'll go viral. Totally. Giuliani <laughs> freaks out. <laughs> he would, didn't he do some like some appearance? Oh no, he did SNL. Something about pro wrestling, I think I remember. Really? But I'm like imagining this. <laughs> well, remember there was a, I mean, I think we were both like pretty young when this was the case, but there there was a time where like everybody liked him. Yeah, did, he just yeah, went he around like, arresting homeless people, saying he was like cleaning up the streets. Yeah, and people were like, like, cool, good job. <laughs> Yeah, until people realized like what he was doing and why like there were no more homeless people on the streets. Like people were like, "Oh, they must have homes." No, they're in prison and they're probably yeah. making your hand sanitizer. Mm -hmm. So, it's just um it's a cruel world and we have a lot of work to do. I don't know what um honestly my my team is very anxious to do something again. I know I need a lot more sleep before I really think about it. But um I will say this is not my last race and I'm not going anywhere. So we just have to figure out what is next. All right. So so it's going to be something but it will be something in the electoral sphere. Yeah. All yeah. Right. Okay. In some right. some way, I'm not quite sure what it is. I know, like, I'm really anxious to get started on some of the collaboration and projects that I've talked with other activists about that'll continue to help my community and um, lots of Animal Crossing, but also still <laughs> lots of helping you my really community. <laughs> are, are, hopefully, they're they're going to be a sponsor of your next campaign. Animal, I, I've yeah. I've never <laughs> I've never I've never played it before, but I, I've heard I've heard it's fun. Don't start because I will I, I will tell you it's I don't know what it is. It's kind of like a, a very large virtual Zen garden, but you can't really stop. You're like, I just need I need to plant another garden right here. <laughs> and if I sell well, and that, it, and that and that helps you because you're planting a real garden. You're going to do a community garden. So this is like, you know, uh, this is your feel good activity to prep you to, to get your hands dirty, pun intended, right? I see what you're, I see what you're doing there. See, <laughs> see, Paul, this is a real experience. <laughs> well, I mean, that's great. And, and yeah, I mean, I ask about the local question because that is something that I do feel, you know, I just kind of look around, I'm like, okay, imagine if every city council had a Samazuant on it. I mean, I mean, Matt, we'd have a different country and, and you know, I, I get, I get a lot of emails from people running for office. And, and, and again, I applaud everybody's effort. I really do. I try to have on as many lefties as I can to try to help them out. Um, but I really wish there was more, Hey, I'm running for city council. Hey, I'm running for mayor. Hey, I'm running for school board as opposed to just, I'm running for Congress. I'm running for Senate. And I get it. You know, I applaud it, but I'm just like, man, see, there's more accountability locally. There's mm. way more accountability. And it's like, I'm not going to say there's not corruption in local politics. Of course there is, especially where you live and, and where I live, you know, especially where, where both of us live. Uh, yeah. Of course it happens. I'm, I'm not that naive, but it's like, you know, you get a couple allies in there who will stand with the protesters when it happens, who will let people into city hall when it's time. Mm -hmm. that that's going to change a country. That really is when you have one of those in every city, you know? Really? Yeah. I know like for, um, for city council here in, in my city council district, 
I'm really excited. Um, one of my friends is actually running to represent me, so I get to support her this time. Um, yeah. So you're, I, so you're kind of building a coalition. Yeah. See, yeah. That's, that's also a cool totally. way to go. Yeah. So, so. I'm, so, I'm very excited. Um, we well, have wait, if this coalition, if you get someone in every district, then, <laughs> then, I mean, the next step, I mean, this coalition is pretty big. You got to do mayor now. <laughs> yeah, totally. You got to do mayor. You have that moment with Giuliani. It goes viral. You're the next mayor. I think we have a plan. Love it. Love <laughs> it. <laughs> get your news on with Rhonda. Do you want to know what's going on? We're getting our news on today. Get your news on with Rhonda. Do you want to know what's going on? We're getting our news on today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can tweet me an article at Ron Placone. We'll go through it together and 